Tassadar was taken into adjudicator, uh, adjudicator custody and sentenced to stand trial for his uh, crimes against the Conclave. Phoenix, Raynor, and Tassadar's followers escaped from the Conclave's agents as the Dark Templar slipped away in the chaos. The Trial of Tassadar. Protoss command ship Thor, holding orbit over the planet Ire. In Thorough and two minutes, Sakito. All seems lost now, but still we must fight on. We must find Tassadar and secure his release from the Judicator before they can execute him for treason. Without him, I fear there is no way to defeat the Zerg and their overmind. Zeratul and his Dark Templar have vanished, leaving us to fend for ourselves. I wonder if Tassadar was mistaken to have put his trust in them. We are receiving a transmission from Captain Raynor's command ship. This is Raynor. I'd like to help if I can. Tassadar laid it on the line for me and my crew on Char. I'd like to repay the debt. Besides, I'm a long way from home, surrounded by hostile aliens. I've got to do something. Then you shall, old human. You shall. End of briefing. Hello, and welcome back to more Let's Play StarCraft. In the previous episode, we finished the 7th level, and now we are on the 8th level. In this level, we will be destroying, destroying the stasis cell in which Tassadar is trapped in because he sacrificed himself for some reason in the last episode, even though we were destroying them. He couldn't stand to see it, and it was kind of pointless. He could have done that to begin with. Anywho, Phoenix and Rainer must survive as well. Without further ado, I've not done this level ever, don't have a clue what it's about. Let's go for it. What I do know is we get carriers. Carriers uh, attack by launching the small inceptors, which is this tip actually. Uh, that swarm their target to build inceptors. It's basically these giant things that we've been seeing. They're pretty nice. But what we're gonna first have to do is probably get this base set up, which we got this area here where enemies can come from, and this area here that enemies can come from. I only know that because I can see this little map thing sitting next to me in my book. It's probably cheating, but, you know, uh, I never claim to be good at this game, to be honest. So, there's that. But anyway, I'm going to assume we need to defend both these areas, and that would be a good reason why. Now, Inceptors can't, or the Carriers can't attack unless they have Inceptors on them. I think they can have like 15 Inceptors each. Could be wrong on that point, but, you know, whichever. Um, why did I just get this like extreme urge for coffee? I don't even know. I just get this strong urge right now for coffee. That's weird. Anyway. Um, what we're going to have to do first is go ahead and uh, get a base started up so that we can go ahead and... Uh, we, we really just need to get a defense going so that we don't just ultimately die here real quick. So what I'm gonna do here real quick, I won't, I won't edit it out because we will be like constantly attacked as far as I am aware. So what I'm really gonna do is probably either speed this up or, or just let it play. I might be a little silent, you don't know, you know, maybe. Just because I'm trying to focus. With the other levels, I would I had done them, so it was kind of like it's, it wasn't anything really new per se. So I wasn't so taken off guard. I mean, it was new, but I mean, I don't I don't think I ever beat the Zerg campaign, or if I I can't remember. I know I've never done the Protoss campaign. I've only seen it. So with it being new things, I'm trying to kind of focus on what's going on, but not entirely too focused on it. You know what I mean? Well, anyway. 
I probably need to get this here so I can actually start building a fence. I'm basically going to take a whole bunch of uh, photon cannons and put them over there. Put one here. Alright, this one should be up here in a second. So we're going to go ahead and get these going here. Get another one. That should get a healthy amount of them over there. And of course they would attack on the one side I didn't defend. But that works for me, actually. Now, I do want to go ahead and get some people on this assimilator so that we can get some gas going. So best being gas needs to be harvested. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Oop, we got a carrier. Come on, you guys. You group. Group here. You two and Phoenix. Come over and... Okay, never mind. You all back up. That didn't go really well, but I mean, I guess no one died specifically. So that's not bad. Oh, they can only have four Inceptors? I thought they could have more. Oh, well. I'm going to send this carrier over here to help defend this area just a little bit. These guys can stay over here and defend this. Um, let's see. Still want to get you guys going. So, you guys work on the Assimilator. We still need more drones working on the mining of minerals. And once I can get some good minerals going, I'll defend this side with the same setup as this. If I can. Get mining. What else do we have here? We have a forge already. That's good. That's it. We don't even have a gateway to our name. That's wonderful. So we're going to have to get that ready. I think I'll put one more guy over on this. Just so that there's always one person in there. And then with this last guy. I do like whenever... Uh, StarCraft 2 tells you how many... Uh, Protoss or miners you can have on an object before it's like not really efficient or anything because on this one you can have like so many over here by the way that's how that works you can have just so many of these drones going but you don't know like if you have too many on one thing but in Starcraft 2 it will tell you like three out of three workers required before it's efficient you might go one over it just so that it's, you know, as efficient as it needs to be. But, you know, it's nothing terrible. These are air units, so this Reaver is destroyed. Pretty dang well. Get out of here, you punk. Get killed. There we go. We get back over here. And... Where's... Where's my guy? Where is my little drone? There he is. I want you to build this here. Here. This actually wasn't that great. Oh, position. 
I don't want to have this Nexus here, but whatever. It's probably going to be worse off that it's on the outside than on the inside, but what can you do, right? Probably need to get other things going. Though. So let's go ahead and get a forge there. And I'll probably want a third one just so that we can maximize on getting things ready. Actually, I'm going to... Oh no, I can't cancel that warp. That sucks. You can't capsule cancel warps. Uh, what I was going to say is I, I'll probably only need to get... Uh, air units for this go because once you ha once you can make carriers basically that's all you capitalize on I'll be honest that's how protoss work once you can get carriers you just make a shit ton of carriers and then you win that's really just how it works let's go ahead and get this going so I mean I'm gonna have ground units here to help defend but other than that mostly just gonna be carriers can't build there. Of course you can. There you go. Let's go ahead and get a couple of you, more of you built. And I can build you over here somewhere. I don't want it too close. Just put it right there. How about it? But I'm going to go ahead and upgrade anything that can actually... So I can get that. Once I get this built up here, I'll be able to, uh... Get the Stargate built. A fleet beacon's probably required to get the carriers out. To be honest, I should probably make up some of these... Ooh, hello. Okay, that's not terrible. But, I'll go ahead and send these guys over anyway. I don't want the carrier to have to deal with everything. Because they just destroyed all six of those. Great. Perfect result. That's what I was looking for. That's what I wanted to happen, right? Uh, hello? No one else felt like coming over. I'm cool with that, actually. Get a Stargate going. Apparently you can go ahead and fix all this. One, two, three, four, five. Six will work. There we go. Giant waste of minerals, but like I said, what can you do? Absolutely nothing. What I can do though, I'll get some of these guys over there. We can upgrade air armor and defense though. That will work. I'm gonna guess, yep, we need a fleet beacon for that. How much is Fleet Beacon? Shouldn't be too terrible to get out. We'll just wait for the minerals to come in. There we go. Get the Fleet Beacon there. You, I want over there. Oh, I got really concerned when I heard that. I thought I was under attack. <laughs> it was me sending my own thing, but it, it, it worried me. That, that's nice. We're gonna want a couple of Stargates going, actually. At least. Once I can get a carrier out, that's, that's get, things are gonna get easier. Because so we already have this one over here. I'll get another one going over here, so that's gonna be defended as well. We'll have those guys going as well. So that will defend those areas. Alright, how much is a carrier? It's not terrible, to be honest. 350 and 300. Can I actually get one going now? Opening warp gate. 
Thomas. Where at? Kill him. They must have some upgraded weapons already. Cause dang. Let's create scout sights and movement. Oh, plus four to inceptors. I will in fact do that. Cause that will work for my carriers. I'll I can do that. Eight inceptors? That'd be nice. You go ahead and come over here. You go ahead and come over here. Ooh, can they not get out? I guess not. More of the reason to get this guy over here, because when I do, he'll be able to get the Inceptors going. I should probably get another gateway just in case. You never know. Carrier has arrived. We'll get those four going. And you over here. Because you will help a ton. I also want you to hold your position there. Hold it right there. Because I don't want him chasing after anything. Because that would be unfortunate. Get him killed. Come on. You guys can do it. Get in there. Kill him. You can kill him. What upgrades complete? How many of these guys can I get in? Ah, it's this one then. Four more over here. Now, we really just need to go ahead and wait on... We'll work on air armor real quick. We're just gonna upgrade air forces. Um, work on getting uh, carriers out. We need to get enough minerals so that we can get a bunch of carriers out. But once that's good, good and all, then, you know, we'll just chill. We'll go ahead and save real quick. Call this Tassadar. Uh, one. That'll work. Test our one. Because we've done decently so far. Wish we hadn't warped that in, because I probably won't need it. I mean, I can upgrade plasma shields. Because that on all units, I guess. I'm gonna go ahead and scout out a little bit over here, to be honest. 
because I'm actually wanting to say it looks like we can't go to this place on foot. Oh wait, we might be able to. It looks like this is a trench area, not a not an island. I might have been going the wrong way, though. I don't know. We are under attack. That works. Oh, come on, guys. Quit. Quit being slow on the vest being gas, eh? How useful these carriers are. Look at that. Look at that. So dang good. You guys might want to either attack or back up. Actually, I want you to back up. The carriers can deal with it. Kill him! Come on, there ain't gonna be crap. I understand we're under attack. We're killing him though. What are you doing? It's not like I disapprove, but I mean, you got some nice dance moves going on there. It's got a really good dance move going on. Your command. Affirmative. Instructions. Get those going. Instructions. Your command. Uh Ow. Kill him. Carrier over there, but warriors have engaged the enemy. Confirmed. Get up here. I don't need you guys fraternizing with those kind of people. That's not healthy on your life.
Ooh, just enough units. Let's go ahead and get some more pylons built, why don't we? to mining with you. Then we can get air armor to three. See, my issue with... I don't know if I should be upgrading this as well because these guys don't technically use any ammo, but the Inceptors do, don't they? I think I'll go ahead and try it. I don't know. Something tells me I should. almost wonder. Wait, we just saved. It wouldn't be that bad if I just... Let's see if I can just send these guys right down the middle. See what they can do already. Kill them! I mean, how bad can it be? These guys are pretty badass. Let's see here. I think we are a giant island, though. Unfortunately. Yeah, there's water blocking us from this other area. Gogojura? Are they saying Godzilla just in a really weird way? Come on, kill him! You can do it, your carriers. You're good at killing things. Ah, crap. Maybe if I had a few more. There's the stasis. Ah, stasis cell. The warriors have engaged the enemy. Which ones? Oh, this guy? What do you think you're doing? Get over here. What are you doing, guys? Come on, get unfrozen. Come on, get unfrozen. I'm gonna reload anyway, but I just want to see like how much this stasis cell has, etc. Let's see. Come on. You froze them again. Thanks, game. I just wanted to get close enough to see the stasis cell. You can see it, it's right there. Ooh, do I actually have to get an enemy unit on that? I thought I had to destroy it. If I have to get like a ze zealot or something on there, that might be a little bit more difficult. And by a little bit, I mean pretty difficult. Get more carriers going. Upgrade complete. Get over there. Oh, come on. You're playing with me now and I don't like Ooh, something can turn them invisible and I don't like that. Is it this arbiter? Can Arbiters turn things invisible? How do Protoss work again? Instructions. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 Come on, you three. Get a little bit closer. That's all I ask. 2,000 health, huh? Just 2,000. It's not terrible.
this rate, these guys are going to keep on freezing. The carriers are going to come out and smack it ever so slowly. Carrier has arrived. Nice. Got an air, another carrier up. I'm just ever so slowly approaching this area. It's kind of amusing. Frozen again, of course. Instructions. Your command. Well, we'll get these interceptors up actually on these two. And then I think I'll send them after the guys as well. I'll just have like a group of these guys like sl You see, because I think they slowly gain their shield back as well. So they're, they're gaining their shield as well as losing it slightly every single time that these guys decide to uh, go after them about this. Have engaged the enemy. Oh, oh, frozen again. This is ridiculous. Instructions. save this as part four and see what happens if I were to send another group of these guys down there. I actually want them to group up over here. Oh no, they're frozen. Half of them are frozen. This is going interestingly well. I'm not sure how to feel about it. Ah, no, that wasn't going well at all. Still, that was interesting. I think I'll load back to this, to be honest. This is Jimmy. Your command. This is Jimmy. Let's go ahead and save Tassadar 5. I want to see what this does, to be honest. Let's just see. Sounds fun. You all meet up here. And let's go ahead and strike. This should be good. Oh yeah. This should be interesting. Sounds fun. This should be good. Sounds fun. This should be good. Sounds I mean, with fun. so many interceptors, they'll probably oh, be going yeah. everywhere, and I can get him in with the Yamada gun. Sounds fun. That Yamada gun's gonna do some damage. Oh, like yeah. real quick. My only issue is going to be with the shields. Right on. They get those shields oh, on these yeah. guys, then things might right get on. a little Sounds interesting. Fun. This should be good. Right on. Oh, yeah. Hey, yep. That didn't work. This should be good. Oh, Run yeah. away. This get back. Right on. Oh, yeah. This should be good. No! Raider can't die. There we go. I just have this whole fleet of carriers that are just screwed by all... Uh, hello? Oh, I see. Phoenix, get back. Whole fleet of carriers that are just frozen. Kill it! We have found Tassadar's stasis cell. 
Destroy the stasis cell. Come on. Come on, guys. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it. You couldn't do it. They couldn't do it. I mean, they might still be able to, but... That was pretty damn good, I'd say. They got a thousand almost off of it. That's frozen again. Try and get Raider in there. Come on. That Yamada got in there. Oh no. Ooh, the Vespine Geyser is depleted, really? That didn't go anywhere. Upgrade complete. Come on! Do it! Oh, Rainer's died. Oh no, it didn't work. Hmm. Oh, come on, get out of that. Jim, get out of there. That didn't work. It's not gonna work. I don't even think I can get these guys over there. I wanna see what they can do. I'm gonna see if they can just come over here. Alright, it's not going terribly yet. What got these ones just now? Oh, there is a path around. Hello. What got him this time around was actually that si Sonic, yeah, the Sonic thing right there. I'm actually just curious, can you guys get up there? Is there a way for you guys to get up there? At all? Ah, there it is. Interesting. You know, I could also get carriers to help them out, but... I'm gonna load anyway, it doesn't matter. Let's think here. Instructions. Commencing. Hmm. 
Let me think, let me think, let me think. gonna be interesting. I mean... We're not gonna be able to take any of the areas down here like this. I highly doubt we would be able to. Try by all means. I don't know, we might be able to. This isn't too terrible. I like how they're assuming I don't know what my carriers are doing. Just because I can't see all of them on the screen. That's kind of amusing. See, this is what carriers are supposed to be capable of. See, you can just wipe out an entire base, just like that. That didn't make them too happy, I'm sure, though. That probably takes a little off. Fact, I could probably go take the other one now. I'll certainly stop some of the uh, attacks coming on. Not all of them, obviously, but some of them. If I can get the attacks to stop, then I might be able to get some ground forces going there. You never know.
Okay. So I might get some pylons going. And... Or not pylons going, but nexus is going in those two areas. Build a nexus over here. You build a nexus over here. And we'll see what we can get done. I think I'll send half of you to go this way with that one. The other half of you to go over this way with that one. And the rest of you, can, I could probably actually figure out a way to get over to here. My, uh, I don't think any of the Inceptors died, actually. That's interesting. Anyway, we got rid of those two bases, though, so things should be quiet for a little bit, at least. Now I'm curious how these guys feel over here. They're probably kind of pissed off, to be honest. But what are they going to do? Absolutely nothing. They can't do anything. Haha. <laughs> Let's get a disseminator belt right there. We could build another base over here if I wanted. Kill him! Hey guys, did you know our warriors engaged the enemy? I know, it was amazing, wasn't it? Get the arbiters killed. Affirmative. No, you're not gonna coax me out. I was trying to coax you out. But it's not gonna work on me. Your command. Okay, get mining. I don't care. I want all of you on that. You guys can start on that assimilator. The other two. Should have been another one on there. Oh well. You can also go on that assimilator. Because why not? Why not? Just do it. Have engaged the enemy. You'll us. Let's see what's going on over here. Just destroy everything. I'm not sure if this is the best way to try and get through. Like a back way or something? Affirmative. If we can get like around coming through the back, maybe they're less defended there. Or something. I don't know. I'm not sure what the best way to try and get through here is. Because it looks like they're defended on all all uh, areas. I mean, this one, this area actually looks better. Slightly, but better nonetheless. I 
I might have one carrier destroyed. You know, if I can get the shuttles around back here, I might be able to get like a whole bunch of my men down here. If I can get a bunch of my men down here, I could do a surprise attack on them. Maybe. They won't know exactly what all to strike. Something like that. I'm not sure. I don't know what the best way to do this is. I long for combat. Let's give this a whirl. Come on, let's do it. Let's see what we can do. Were all my ground units like destroyed instantly? I think they might have been. Get out of that. Come on. Oh, they weren't destroyed instantly. Okay. Actually, come on. Get back here. But I'm going to wait for the carriers to help out. Come on, dudes. Get in there. Fight your way in. Come on. Ever so slowly. Work your way in, guys. Try and get over there. We will attempt to free him now. One second here. She has awaiting instructions. That's my new group too. This might help a little bit. Your command. Your are under attack instructions. Just maybe a little bit, at least. Kill him! Come on! Get them dead! Kill them, kill them, kill them, kill them. Regroup back here. Unless you can kill that one. In fact, actually try and kill him. Come on, guys. We can do this. Get in there. Come on, you can do it. Just destroy the dang thing. Yeah. I expected you to attempt to retrieve your ego. You will learn that the will of the conclave is absolute. Make peace with Adun. Stay thy hand, the Judicator. The stewards of Tassadar shall not fall while the Dark Templar live. Call off your guards and stand aside, and you may yet live to see another moonrise. I will not be addressed so by one so devoid of the Kala's light. You and your vile brethren shall die with these traitors. Are you truly so blinded by your vaunted religion that you cannot see the fall ahead of you? 
Your conclave believes that they are winning this war. But all they have succeeded in doing is helping the Overmind to win. What could you possibly know about our designs, Blasphemer? You speak of knowledge, Judicator. You speak of experience. I have journeyed through the darkness between the most distant stars. I have beheld the births of negative sounds and borne witness to the entropy of entire realities. Unto my experience, Alderus, all that you have built here on Iora is but a fleeting dream. A dream from which your precious conclave shall awaken, finding themselves drowned in a greater nightmare. We shall see. Victory! That took a bloody while. Like an hour, but it took longer because, you know, yay. Restarting levels and such. Anyway, so thank you all for watching. If you liked the video, please like, subscribe, and I will see you all in the next episode where we will continue on with episode... N Mission 9, not episode 9. Mission 9. We're almost finished with the game, guys, other than the expansion, but... Pfft, details. So, if you like... I will see you all in the next episode.